Hi, this is DJ Steve Nice. You're watching wingsound.com. Today I'm going to be showing you how to utilize VST plugins with Ableton Live. What we have here is the Vanguard, which in my eyes is a very good plugin. And that's key. You always got to have a good plugin. Here we go. I'm going to start the setup. Okay, go to next. All right. What I do is go to local disk C. All right. Program files. And I made a folder in Steinberg which shows up sometimes when you even install Ableton, but I made the folder, go to VST plugins. All right. And that's the folder where all my other plugins are. So I'd love to install it there and it'll just show up in Ableton. All right. And so make sure that's highlighted plugins. All right. And press okay. Once you see it on here, you're good to go. Go to your plugin tab, which very simple. Looks like a plug. All right see what we have in there what I just see I, I went to put the Vanguard in there but you know it's not in there so you got to go to preferences but you want to browse VST plugin custom folder if you have them all in one folder and none of them are showing up you pick that one folder and you rescan it and they should show up but since I only want the one I'm gonna go into the VST plugins file we're gonna scan that right here there's the Vanguard that's the VST that we installed Let's uh, pull the Vanguard up. So that's how you install and or import external plugins to use in Ableton Live for making bass lines and any other sounds that you want to do. Well, I hope these videos really helped you in your future endeavors in making electronic music. And whatever it is that you're making, just make sure it's tailored to your own personality. Thanks for watching. Um, some of my affiliates are Groove Therapy, Rustic Productions, Warehouse Massive. I'm from Brooklyn, New York, Binghamton Upstate. If you want to contact me, my email is stevenice at winksound.com.